Anna Haverman, and I'm with MPC News Online here at the 2020 Omaha Pro. I'm here with Brittany Watts, the uh, women's physique champion. And let me tell you, she looks awesome. Congratulations, by the way. Thank you so much. Thank and I just had a question. How were you able to prep through COVID? How many times did your show get postponed? Girl, what's up? Well, a uh, very interesting story. I started prep, like, I believe January. Um, everything was going good, off to a great start. I had planned on doing the Tim Gardner show in Fort Lauderdale, the Flex Vibes or Atlantic Coast something or another. Show got canceled. COVID hit. Gyms closed. We're scrambling around looking for pieces of equipment because everything in the world, pretty much, was, like, selling out, like left and right could barely find any equipment so me and my man we bought you know a squat rack and a, and a straight bar and bumper plates and and 45 pound plates and little old old school dumbbells that you plate loaded you know and whatever we could find and we're working out at the house trying to do cardio at home we live third floor apartment we're outside every morning running up and down stairs like training rocky style you know like crazy our neighbors think we're psychotic you know they just see us buying equipment one piece at a time bringing it into our house and the guy next door he's like sees us he's like oh my god like you guys are crazy what are you buying now and we're like oh we just got this you know and it's like it, it was kind of difficult, but you know, once we found enough equipment and we got into the routine of not going to a normal gym anymore, um, it made everything much easier, you know, uh, with stuff being shut down and not being able to work. That was super crazy, but um, you know, finally things reopened back up and we were able to start training somewhat normal again, you know, even though the gym's open, my, my gym looks like a crime scene, like everything's taped off, like caution tape, but um, we ended up, you know, making it through and able to train and here we are today and even though the Tim show got canceled and then I was supposed to do the Prestige Cup in Boca and that got canceled on Monday and, excuse me, by that time I was just like so used to everything just going wrong that by now I'm not even affected. I was just like, okay, after I saw it, I got up, did my cardio, made my breakfast, I called my coach and he was like, oh, I, I wish you could do the Omaha and I was like, well... Let me call you right back. So I got on the phone and I started calling and booking and I was like, all right, we're going to Omaha. And he was like, oh, okay, wow, change of plans. So here we are now. So God, yay. that's awesome. So what are your upcoming plans for the Olympia? What's your next step? Are you going to get with your coach or relax, eat some food? Mm, food. <laughs> I don't know about the food yet. But um, yeah, everything here is closed. So I'll probably just chill, wait till I get back home to, you know, venture out into the world to find some some food. But um, I'm just going to sit. I'm, I, I'm still probably going to end up going down to the Tampa show if, if it is held um, to support, you know, the, the IFBB and PC and go see the Tim Gardner show. I've never been. I love Tim Gardner shows. I love to go to the uh, Muscle Vodka party because I've never been to one. I always end up having to leave town, you know, whenever there is one. So I'm going to go party and then <laughs> and then, you know, get ready for Olympia. Awesome. Well, that's awesome. Congratulations on your win tonight. Thank you so much, Anna. Appreciate mm -hmm. it. Nice.